In this question, the correct answer does not depend on the value of the investment. So we can work with the case in which the investment is $100. In the first year, therefore, it increases by 10% to $110. Then it increases by 5%. Since 5% is half of 10%, we can move the decimal point to see that 10% of 110 is 11. And it increases by half of that, so it increases to 115.5. In the final year, it decreases by 10%. Again, by moving the decimal point, we can see that 10% of the current value is $11.55. Subtracting, we obtain $103.95 as the current value. Since the original value was $100, the current value is 103.95% of the original value. The correct answer is B.